Well, that's the great thing about the Wizard World events. You really actually get a chance to practice and try out the game and really learn it. And uh, let's see how how it paid off. Oh, nice giant swing opens up the round with a huge life lead. So Brawl Pro looking to close out this first round. Sparrow Jin right now in a big life disadvantage. Oh, wow. Now, if you're Sparrow Jin and you actually, you know, missed a, a few Tekken games, like not playing as competitive as oh, you did before, God. what do you think is going to be key for him to be able to take out uh, Brawl, someone that's been playing competitively for the past few games? Well, you got to remember, like you said, he's a he's a... An OG player. He's been playing for so long, and Brawl Pro is kind of new. I feel like that's what's gonna make the difference if there will be one. The fact that he has these those those lower fundamentals on Tekken than most people. And obviously, Brawl Pro knows his character, able to punish that uh, that with just frame. Oh, good stuff here for both players right now. The wall pressure from Sparrowjin, though, very scary. Good punish. Oh, four four, nice. Oh, Magic Four tries to go for the, the Axe Dash Two. Wow, gets the demo man to take the second round. And you know, he's getting those, uh, Sparrow Jin's knocking those cobwebs off. He's getting back in there. Yeah, so far doing a great job, but doesn't break the two grab there. And throws are a bit easier to break in this game, especially the Whoa. normal grabs. Wow, gets the counter hit between those. Nice shoulder check. Wow, I like how Sparrow is like, he's, he's gearing up right now. Oh, wow. He went for a reversal, too. Oh, power bomb down to the ground. He's in rage, though. This is where Paul's very oh, dangerous. Wow. Believe it or not, that is a setup that's always been in Tekken. Like, I've always seen that setup before, and it definitely works really well. Yeah, running exploder to the back of the head. Uh oh, man. He got the multi throw. Are we going to the King's Bridge? Yup. It's not the regular bridge. This is the King's Bridge. And this is not going to be a good look because this is a lot of life Ugh. off of oh, Paul's life bar. Wow. Sparrowjin's going to have to really make a comeback. Oh, my oh, gosh. Wow. He planned that whole thing. And this might be a perfect. Oh, Very wait, close wait. Down 4 1. Oh, wow. Down 3 4. Spiritual not looking too good on his first matchup to do when it comes to exposure to the game. Yeah, when it comes to competition, you got to play. That, that's the key. Exactly. Especially when learning a new game. Oh, oh wow. wow. That was good stuff. That was really sick. That was a clutch duck, able to get some good damage off of it. Now pushing towards the wall. Bronco oh, nice. sitting comfortably with that lead, but Spiritual playing very active. Uh, Brawl Pro actually has a lot of options to punch to Death Fist now. The Death Fist being at least negative 17, he could do a lot of things. He wants to get a knockdown, he wants to keep the pressure right. on. But either way, he is looking good here this opening round. Nice, 4-4-1 four, four, goes right in the giant swing. That's going to be the round regardless if he takes it or not. Alright, so Brawl Pro looking really strong in the second matchup. Looking to move on throughout the winner's bracket. Oh, wow. wow. And there, there is no mix-up after that. That's either high or low. Wow, delayed those pop options. kick goes for almost max damage right there. Using a 4-3. Gets the combo. Nice 40% damage right there. Nice break on the multi throw. Oh Death Fist, God. don't you ever. Oh, well, we're out of one. Hey, good pressure from Sparrow Jin. Down 4-1. Oh, oh, full crouch down 4-2. This is going to hurt. Not and dead yet, but it's going to put him in the rage. It's going to hurt big time. And Brawl Pro seems to be scouting out those opportunities where throws comes out. He's ready. He's on deck with the, the gut punch there. Oh, once again, that that, that alley kick. Wow. So, potentially the last round here. If Brawl Pro takes this, he'll be moving on. Let's see if Sparrow is able to make some adjustments here. Okay. Opting to play a bit more methodical. Not too aggressive, but then he gets whiff punished. Oh, wow. wow. Gets clipped by the demo man. I don't think he was ready for that one. Down back three. Nice dance. And you can see that uh, Brawl Pro has a little, his movement. Pretty good. Oh, wow. Does not break the Shining Wizard. Oh, that wow. That was bad. really dangerous. Still anybody's match. You can't call, count out Paul. Oh, no. Except if he does that do again. Not do that. You lose. That was a big risk, but. Oh, that red color looks really sick. Oh, nice punish on the dragon oh, slide. Able nice to get the full punish. combo. Already. And Rick right out of the gate showing, like, I'm going to punish you. Oh, wow. Rise right, two. All right, good pressure here now. Uh oh. Wow. Not looking good for Rip. Now Ooh. back to the wall. But able to get that clutch wall rising, too. Now he's going to push away. He's going to get the legend kick combo. No, he drops it. Now this is going to be a test because, I mean, both of these players have excellent spacing and defense. Wow, what a slide from Rip right there. That was really good. And that's what I like to see from Rip. I mean, obviously he got the slide blocked at the opening part of the round, but he's still not afraid to do it. you got to trust in it and believe in it. He kind of gave him that Twitch move. He got really close and was like, I'm going to duck and see how you react. Oh, runs in down 4-1. Spacing not so conventional that that, um, that Rick is doing, but in fact it's paying off. It's working. Wow. Able to land that back three. 
pushing him towards the wall. Wow, great sidestep there from Rip. And here's a follow-up. And Rip the Ruler looking really good right now. Here's a follow-up. Good pressure on both sides. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, nice. Caught him out of the air. One. Round three. Fight. All right, here comes more pressure. Back turn. Oh, oh dragon slide. Right through the power crush. And again, Lowe's will beat out the power crush. Moves oh, low. nice 4 4 3. Oh, Caught nice down 4 1. Okay, nice throw break. I like the spacing that's on display right now. Caught him out of the air. This is going to be a mini combo. Should get some decent damage here. Oh, side wall stun. Not able to get the full juggle. Nice poking here. Oh, he had the Rip. duck oh, too. He ducks it. Well, Ryzen 2, nice punish. You can't get away with that. Back 2 2 for the best gameplay because now it's not as dangerous. So that makes him just a stronger player all around because he can actually break throws. And that's actually, I think that's pretty key because as a player, you become more confident in your gameplay. Yep. Not having to worry too much. But then Rip just opening it up with an amazing round. Was he sandbagging? Who wow. Knows? Wow, he was, wow, that slow motion at the end. Oh, man. Slow motion for me. Here we go. Rip on the scoreboard. Finally gets the first round. Oh, oh down 2-3. Hits him with Rip's favorite move. Yeah, that I was about to say. <laughs> oh, wow. He tries to hit Rip with the Rip. You can't do that. Disrespect here. Oh, breaks the floor. Going downtown. Oh. Okay. Okay, see, right now Rick is playing a, a little bit loose. Yeah, he has that confidence. I mean, he has he has some some rounds to play around with here, but we'll see Rip right now. Good opportunity. He's gonna spike. He does. No, misses the follow up. Oh, good break on the grab there. We were just talking about Karen. down two three. The Rip special. Are we gonna see? Are we gonna see him? He's gonna even it up with three straight rounds of his own. Are we gonna see that? Oh, oh. dragon slide goes for the junkyard legend kick. Yo, I'm just gonna do flip kick. I don't even care. Oh, great oh while rising too. That was a great way to whip punish. He's gonna push him towards the wall. This is gonna be big damage. Oh, oh down two damn. three. It's not over. It's not over. Definitely not. Oh, he misses the DSS cancel there. But he puts Law into rage. You're gonna have to be very careful. Goes for the low damn. option. Runs in down three four again. Rip. Just look. I'm hitting this button, but it doesn't matter because you lost. It doesn't matter what button you hit. <laughs> Oh, the delay on the junkyard. Oh, missed Dragon Slide right there. Oh, oh he yo, do. He's hitting Rip with the Rip. How does it feel, Rip? He's yeah. going to do it anyway. He definitely scouted all the options there. Now looking real good for Rick the Ruler. Looking to even up the rounds here. Let's see if Rip can fight back. Oh, he went for a Dragon oh, Tail. Wow. That was big. Okay, this round could have been over a few times. All right, that was a nice, simple punish. Normally that wouldn't work. But it put he was on the wall, so it pushed him back not far enough. It's a great adva advantageous uh, decision there. Oh wow, interesting. Oh, nice parry, but no follow-up attack. He could hit a few buttons after that. While wow, rising one. Oh, oh wow, four, four, three on the wall. Oh no, DSS cancel goes for the throw. Rick the Rule is definitely feeling himself right now. Rip needs to make something happen. He wow. needs this game to stay alive. That was the right read from Rip there, too, but a little bit too early. Yo, running slide. What is he going to do? He's in rage right now. Oh, oh my God. Dragon slide of his own. Is it? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The jet wins out. Wow. And Rick the Ruler takes it. Rick the Ruler it. takes it. Oh, they're celebrating on stage. With the mini pop-off. With the mini pop-off. That's just, that's just one match. It's, it's, he's not even in the finals yet. I know. Fight. All right, All nice right. down for the start. Oh, wow. wow. Getting it started early. Here are the Dragons that say this is a throwback stage to Tekken 5. Oh, could have ducked it. Oh, wow. Okay. Doing a great job spacing right now. I mean, no one really landing a clean hit. No big damage dealt yet. But, again, all, all those lows are chipping away right now against Slayer. Oh, nice. This going to be a mini combo. Doesn't get the full juggle. But the way Hase was playing, he's, he's, he's like, he's, oh, okay. wow, and never that's mind. What we were waiting and it's for. even now. Could have got, got away with another death fist there. That should be it. They're kind of like picking at each other. I feel like they play each other enough to where right now, I don't know if they actually play each other, but they, they're playing, you know, really careful right now. Well, that was a good evasive shoulder to open up the round. Oh, nice combo. All right, here's the follow up. What's he going to do? Oh, he went oh. for the spike and the flip. Oh, oh nice counter. Don't get up. Okay, there you go. 
He would have oh, oh, counter wow. hit death fist. And right back to e almost even again. And you're going to have to be careful. You can't whiff moves against Paul. Otherwise, oh. he's going to do stuff like that. Shredder kicks. Down for one to take it. And that's such a scary thing. You have your back to the wall and Paul is coming at you. You don't know what he's going to do. Either way, you're going to get knocked down and it's going to hurt. So right now, the rain is pouring. And someone is going to be crying after this. We'll see. Oh, and again, wow. the loser of this match is going to be out of the tournament. This is loser's bracket action. Oh, wow. Nice wall carry there. Here's the option. What's going to happen? On wake up, nice three to four sweep. Follow up, and that's it. Oh, wow. wow. Perfect. It's not, it's not over. It's not over. All right. Good pressure right now. Oh, no break on the throw. Gets him with the classic jab to throw. Gets a follow up. Oh, kind of waited for it. Oh, oh my gosh. wow. That that's going to hit. That should hit. hit. Yep. Nice rage right here. But still has a lot of life to make up on the deficit here. Oh, oh my goodness. Wow. Is this going to be a huge comeback? Right at the wall. Here's the mix up. Now he has rage available. Oh, wow. Right in the four. Okay, all right. That is. The Devil's Pit, second, uh, second part of the transformation being the other one without walls. So let's see what happens here. Oh wow, nice. Good stop there. Oh, counter hit. This is going to be big damage. Oh wow. Into the death fist. Ooh, look at that damage. Good stuff. Nice. Slayer's playing really patient right now. Gets the 4 4 2. Nice trade. Yeah, both players really respecting each other right now. Oh, that's going to be it. And that trooper roll, whenever it lands, gets a free juggle now. Paul able to do a full damage juggle with the screw follow up. Oh, had the counter hit there. Did not uh, pull the trigger though. Oh, counter hit. This is going to oh, potentially wow. be big damage. Could have been. No combo. Probably got a little nervous when expecting it to hit. Now that's a, such a great move this time around. Obviously safe. Has evasive properties. If you get the counter hit, you get big damage. Always a good option there with Paul. A couple of few great blocks there from Hasio EX. But it doesn't work out too well. As you see right now, Slayer goes up two rounds. Round Potential set point for Slayer. Yeah, just like that. Oh, good stuff. Here's the pressure from Asio. Unhand me. No duck on the second part of that. Oh, caught him. This is going to hurt. Into the death fist. Nice and simple. Oh, slides at one. Interesting. I like the pressure the Slayer is putting on right now. I also like the fact that Hasio is holding his ground. He's yeah. not He's not budging. Oh, wow. That is going to hurt. So much damage. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Didn't go for the bound, but still ends up taking the round with That blocks. was a lot of damage. That was a <laughs> lot of damage in a short amount of time. That was a tail of the counter hit. All right. Good evasive attack there. No punish, though. Oh, that wow. was a great whiff punish. Now pushing again further. Oh, no mix-up. Drops the combo, too. Goes for the throw, no break. 4 4 4. Oh, had the hit there. Katia doing a lot of work in this round. Slayer's gonna have to make a comeback here. Let's see what happens. Oh, oh puts wow. the brakes on. Hasio didn't budge though. He was like, nope, Ooh, I'm not moving. Hit. And here comes Hasio. Needs this, this could, round to stay alive. This could be the opportunity. Oh. Did it budge? I like the patience here from Slayer. Slayer really trying to control the pace of this round. Oh, there was a death fist attempt there. It got counter hit for it, and this is big damage right now. Holy crap! Oh wow! And that's gonna hurt is a he lot. Really gonna bring this back right now? Oh, down four. And if there's any time to land death Slayer, fist, now is the as time. As we say in St. Louis, only a real man. Never mind. Never mind. Not today. So just like that, evened up on match. You Speaking know, of looking good, Tekken 7 starting up. Final match between these two. We're in the jungle. Oh, nice. Nice able, dancing. Able to scout out the nice 4 forward to do some solid damage here. Oh, great block. Bad punish, though. Could have had a full launch. Oh, nice. Oh, oh here we back go. Down 4 2. Trying to go for Death Fist. Didn't get the input. Does the second part while we're at the take the round. Got to respect that Hasio went for the gamble there. Down back four on block. Still continued the string. Got punished for it, though. Slayer looking a lot more comfortable this match. Nice follow up there. Able to make the adjustment. Here we go. Oh, good challenge oh, there. Gets wow. the counter hit, but does not stop. Oh, wow. Just punches his foot. <laughs> Punched him in the ankle. 
Down four. Nice. Just the up four three. I like it. Yo. Caught him moving. Hasio just inching in like, yo, if you hit a button right now. It's going to hurt. Just chopping away at uh, Slayer right now. Look at that. And earlier, Slayer was looking like he was going to take it. But right now, Hasio putting up a really good fight. And again, this is the loser's bracket. So the loser of this match will end up going home. Tied for seven. Ooh, good stuff there. And you can now do that from Crouch now. Oh, wow. Ooh. Good stuff here. Again, great pressure. There's the two grab. Oh, nice break. Whoa, can't whip it in the open like that. Here's a follow up. What's going to happen? Oh, it drops the combo. Doesn't matter. It should be able to close it out here. Nice. Whoa, oh, no. Still alive. Oh, went for the death fist. That, I mean, that was a safe option. If he landed that death yeah. fist, that would have hurt. <laughs> nice. You got to live and die by it. Side step if you grab. Pasio say, no, I, I know how to break these throws. Yeah, Pasio, one round away from moving on. Get out. Oh, unhand me. Okay. Nice break. Great stuff. Yeah. Both players playing s such a great job defensively. Not letting the throws get to him. Oh, good block. Nice block. Walks into the down four, too. Let's see what happens. Here's the follow-up. Here's the mix-up at the wall. Oh, good block. Oh, there's the punish you were talking about. There you go. Into the death fist. Now, this is going to be interesting. Now, the back to the wall. Got to be very careful. Oh, oh my god. Can, 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 can. kicks. Lance counter hit. This is going to be big damage. Uh-oh. Not a good place to be. Got to be careful. Oh, one of the wow. counter. That was sick. Oh, my god. That was brave. Slayer. A brave soul out here. Such a huge risk at the end of the round. It could have paid off big time, but oh, unfortunately did not. Oh, just frame throw. Nice. And if we're here it's down to the final round between these two, the winner of this match will move on. Loser will go home. Oh, wow. What a whiff punish. This could be big damage, Steve. Oh, drops the combo. Want to try to get the spike, and that's what happens. To get the spike at the end of a bunch of combos in this game, they are a little more difficult because you have to dash forward in order to get them. Yep. In some instances give you better Oki. Wow, nice That's punish. Back one to When you're close to the wall like that, you can't. Oh, oh my, my goodness. God. And just like that, it ends with it. What happens? Fight. All right, great spacing to open up the round. Jody the Great oh, nice using one of the better characters in the game. I mean, Devil Jin, no, no slouch either. He's just a very execution-heavy character. Yeah, and, and I've known AJ for quite some time. Going from pad to arcade stick, he's still able to do the harder stuff with the character. Down four to take the round. But even still, you have to remember the advantage actually goes to Jody because he's playing a new character versus a, a, a character that he's always used before. No punish on the hop kick, and it's really strange because you never, you're not used to seeing it. Yet. Yep. Great combo there from uh, Shantan Talon. Pushes towards the wall, did, does not let her rip, had the opportunity there. Wow, lasers. Nice dancing. Yep. Got to be careful though, Shaheen. Such a beast when it comes to close quarters. Oh, no punish on that hop kick. Like I said, it's re it's really weird because you're not used to seeing this character. So yeah, he's just flying through the air, doing hop kicks and flips and everything. One, two, down four. Oh, no. four, one, man. Okay, and goes for the hop kick attempt. Okay. Oh, nice one, one, two. Good block. Nice That's block and punish. That's an unbreakable oh. stuff. Oh, he dropped the combo. Went for a power crush. That's very risky, especially with no life left. Was that a bait? It didn't work. <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> it wow. didn't work. I, I, I like was it so though. quiet because I, I was like, yo, it. this is about to work. Round three. He did, we went for the pump fake. <laughs> he didn't go for it though. All right, this is going to be big damage. Goes for the 4 4 3 ender. Nice hit animation. And we are now downstairs. There's no walls left. Nice combo from Jody the Great. Oh, gets his back. Didn't finish his string. Jabs him out of the hop kick. Nice. Gets him with the demon buff. And uh, AJ still has a chance here. Oh, nice duck. A little bit too slow on the reactions there. Really hard to punish that 4 1 string. Oh my gosh. Nice Is that what he wants? From AJ. He has rage though. He could turn this around in oh, an instant. Oh, wow. But just like that, Jody the Great able to clutch it out with that low. On paper, he is probably the weakest. But also, I mean, if someone has a great defensive mindset, they're going to be good with the Mishima no matter what. Yeah. You have the, the power of the health chief, you have the power of the electric. And Heihachi has great mids. He probably is the most dry of all the Mishimas, doesn't have the most flash. 
but he has probably the best mids out of all of them, especially he's, that move right there. He's an old man. What do you expect? He's, he's not here to play games. Yeah, you know, all these kids nowadays, they don't want to play the old guy. They want to play the new cool-looking kids. AJ, such pressure. They, they go to the oh, blood wow. full down four. And so far, the switch is working out for him right now. Old man Heihachi able oh, to wow. do some damage. Oh, good duck there. Oh, oh, wow. That oh, he went, we got those? Blue, blue got Thunder Goddess combos? These blue sparks, though. Okay. Good step there. Oh, wow. Oh, Just threw out the hop wow. kick on Wake Up. That shit closed it out. And Shaheed, wow. Jody the Great. Really careful. Fight. Ugh. Nice. Good duck. Bad punish there. You got to punch that shoulder. Not safe. Oh, caught him with a delayed third hit. Oh, oh. Hashi. That's hop kick punishment, too. He's going to have to be careful. Oh, wow. wow. Nice sidestep double electric. Did not finish the combo, though. Nice down 4 1. Unfamiliar string. That's kind of cheap. Yep. Breaks the throw. Nice. Yeah, oh. Breaks oh, this is going to hurt. Down for a game. And Jody the Great, such a great job of using the lows towards the end of the round. He hasn't had a block really. Oh, he goes for the mixed player. That's not safe, but if you space it properly, mm. it becomes safe. It's really mm. scary. So that mid option. Okay, good punish. Follow up. Wow. And goes for hop kick. AJ really has to seal away the momentum that Jody the Great is. Oh my gosh, this is going to hurt. At the wall, though. Still nice confirmed. Does not break the throw this time, and he goes in the rage. Just see what happens, and he did a hop kick for no reason, and he finishes the stream. I hate this character. And you know Rip, he likes to hit buttons. So yeah. let's see how it turns out. See, oh, like right no there. That would have hit though. me. That would have hit me. And uh, I think that was a good test from Rip. Rip throwing out the wall rising too early on to see if uh, Slayer's able to react or punish it. Okay, good side step three. Here's the follow-up. What's he going to do? Goes oh, for the wow. command grab. No break on the double throw. All right. Gets the bound at the end. Nice combo there from Rip. Wow. Oh, wow. Great option. He goes for the hop over the classic. And there we go. First game, Rip. First round, Rip. Nice block. Good punish there. Gets the combo. Nice. nice. Decent damage there. That's a great, consistent punish off the dragon slide, too. And, and that's very beneficial for Paul because not every character can do that. So. Yeah. Right now, Rip playing very patient. Slayer was working on a perfect there. Ooh, went for the low. That's not going to punch, nice. but that's a good bait there. Ooh. Oh, he went for the Legend King. Nice. Wow, good kept option. him back turn. Looks like he tried to do a crouch and punch himself right there. Yep. And like I said, it, Slayer playing at a very decent pace to keep keep control. Yeah. Um, Rip does like to hit buttons, and he likes to test to make sure you're reacting. All right, good patience there on the junkyard, able to block it. I like to see more people go for the low parry there. That's such a clutch thing to do. Stop I was just the momentum. The same thing. Okay, follow up. Nice slide there from Rip. Oh wow, blocks the low. Now bad position for Law. Oh, oh, you went for the launcher a little bit too late, probably. Oh wow. Oh, it looks like Rip found the formula that he was looking for. That's the second time he's landed that command grab. Nice. Giddy up kicks. Push it the wall. No. Oh, oh my, my goodness. God. You thought you were going to win. You're going to eat this fist. Fight. One more round for Slayer. He'll be able to take the first match. Let's see what happens. Rip. Obviously not letting that death fist phase of wow. Just dodge it. Oh, wow. Oh, here comes down back threes. Is he going to go again? Wow. Not letting up on him. Oh, such a delay there. Not looking good for Slayer at all. Oh, wow, nice. Great patience, though. I mean, he went for the hop key. That was the right read, but not in range. Final right. round here. First game. Nice double dragon. No punish. Ooh, oh, wow, rising, too. Let's see what happens. Let's see, let's see how this turns out. Into the dragon Oh, cannon. lots of damage. Right at 50% life right there. Dragon slap. Into the command grab. Able to break it there. Oh, uh, Rip looking really strong in that yep. final round. So Rip up now, 1-0. This is loser's bracket action, so whoever wins it, turn the tide. Okay. Oh, Rip is just chopping at the legs right now. I think he's going to keep doing that until he gets a reaction out of Slayer. Okay, I think I know exactly how Rip is going to play right now. 
Alright, here we go. Oh, finally goes for the mid there. Oh, wow. Oh! So much damage. That was sick. Oh, it gets a counter hit. Goes for the combo follow-up. A little too far away. Okay. Shipping away, but now Law has rage. This is a very dangerous position, no matter which character you're fighting against. They do extra damage, not only that, they have access to the rage art. Uh-oh. Gets the trade. <gasps> oh. T nice, simple punish. Yeah. Take the round. Don't, yeah. even, don't stretch further than you have to. That's smart. Both players, again, play patient. Yo, I'm all about this song, though. Oh, Got the tools no on deck. Oh, oh, Death Fist, though. I think Rip thought he sidestepped it in time. It's going to get that damage back. Yep. Towards the wall. Oh, dropped it right there. Oh, wow. The mix-up. Back the, the other way. The trickiness. Oh, wow. Quarter circle four, two. This is big damage, too. Oh, Goes for the demo, low. man. And Slayer, two rounds straight. Fight. Oh, goes for the poison arrow. Gets interrupted, though. This is what Slayer needed to do. He's being a little more offensive right now. And he's definitely playing off on him. Yeah, and all the reads that he's been pulling out, they, they've been paying off. Oh, this is a good punish right here. Goes right into the death fist. Continues the offense. I, I like what he's doing. It's like he's pushing him to the wall, making him have to fight in the corner. Okay, here comes Rip. Combo of his own. Now, oh, uh, gets the counter hit. Banana peel again. Now the offense from Rip. Let's see what he does. Oh, oh that would have been big too. Oh, oh, no break. No break on the one throw. Down one. Puts him in rage. What's gonna happen? One, two. And the follow-up, what's gonna happen here? Oh, into the leg oh, kick with backs up. Down forward. Stage where we have multiple uh, floor breaks. Oh, he went for the down forward three series. So Rip is pulling out the move list now. Trying to really test his opponent. Again, gets that elbow. Wow. Slayer is going to do big damage here. Pushes towards the wall. What's he oh, going to do? Oh, wow. Went for the 4 12. Actually this is going to hurt. Throw. This is going to hurt. Oh, nice hop kick there from Rip. He challenges. What's he going to do? Oh. Nice. Good stuff. Into the command grab from DSS. Oh, wow. Back to the catch and technique. That's why you don't do that wow. near the wall, because if you try to roll up it, you're going to get hit back turned a lot of the time. Yeah, that's a bad position to be in, especially... I mean, usually when you're back turned, you yeah. can't block the success of follow-ups. Okay. Now, Rip seemingly in control of this round right now, feeling confident and started going more offensive again. Oh, my gosh. And just as we said it, Death Fist comes out. Slayer making Rip uh, play very honest. Oh, nice. It's the floor break. Then he gets the bound. Oh, nice combo. Rip goes up two rounds. Slayer needs this round to stay alive. Follow up, what's gonna happen? Oh, wow, he keeps running into that. It's the demo man. Pushes him pretty far to the wall. Oh, oh good wow. challenger. I mean, I like what he was doing. He knew a low was coming. Oh, 4 4 2 1 gets to just frame. No combo, though. Definitely could have used what was that damage that was going to be there. Oh, wow. Go good for hop a hop kick. kick. Oh, wow. Still not dead. Oh, my God. So many lucky breaks right now. Nice banana peel and the follow up. What's going to happen? Oh, nice catch on the side step. Oh my Track gosh. Track slide. Track and slide again. Right now, Rip is looking to take it. I mean, Slayer is going to have to really get some of those critical deaths that he had earlier on. Oh my gosh. Oh. Just like that. Dragon Tail to Dragon Tail. Here we go. Fight. Now, uh, this is going to be an interesting match because Sparrow Jin, obviously, he does not know any of the new characters. So we'll see if he's going to just overwhelm Jody the Great with offense or is he going to try to play defensively. Well, like I said, the, the, the advantage goes to Jody the Great character wise as well as, you know, just continuing to play in the game wise because he's, rel he's relatively new. Well, just Tech and Seth, and, and as we all are, but. Spiro is one of those people, he, he learns fast, <laughs> as you can see. And he's very persistent. I mean, he's been doing a lot of work here with Paul. And uh, opens up the first round with a win. Okay. Nice, goes for the 1-4. I mean, he's going, he's going for those mix-ups. He's got to go man. with the classic tried and true. There's the death fist. No punch there from uh, Jody the Great, but it doesn't matter. Hit Just throwing the moves out. 
Oh, no, no throw break. Let's see what happens. Goes for the down four. He gets up just in time. Nice block. Goes for the hop kick right after. No one knows it. It's not fair. It's, uh, it's fair right now. <laughs> Jody's thinking like, yeah, that's fair. I'm going to do it until they punish me. Oh, he just throws oh, wow. it out. Here we go. Just starts it off. Oh, he drops the combo. He was going for the down back two series there. 4-4-2-1. Four, four, Caught him out of the air. And Sparrow did, again, doing a great job spacing against uh, a lot of Shane's folks. Sparrow has a lot of his movement. It's really good. Oh, caught him with the shredder. It's a, wow, he could have won with the back one too there. Something probably he'll have to get used to. Oh, wow. I rise at 4. Down 4 1, sway back. Oh, wow. 4 1. Four, one. This is going to be big damage. What's he going to do? Oh, he oh. went for the radar. I don't know if that's going to... Oh. oh! I hope... Oh, that was definitely not worth it. That's yeah. what you get. Should Trying get to show off and be cute. Uh -huh. that's, what, that's what you get. Well, I mean, it was a good attempt. The Rajar probably could have killed there, but uh, we'll never know since he dropped it. Yeah, I don't know the range on it, but most of the time, once you get the uh, the bound at the end of it, you have to go right into it. Oh, my God, that death is just off so much damage. Is he going to go for it again this time? No, he goes for the wall. Let's see what happens. Still has a good uh, a good chance here. He's going to have to be very careful. Uh-oh, be careful here. Yeah, I won. Oh, oh, my God. My down back God. two. Able to beat out his low. So just like that final round here in this first matchup, Jody the Great versus Sparrow Jane. Good punish there. So finally the hop kick gets punished. Bottom counter hit. Follow up. Down 4-2 right there would have been the best option for Sparrow and it definitely would have hit. Oh wow, the nip up. Oh, Cross wow. arm chop. And again, great challenge here from Sparrow Jin. Not afraid to use that death in clutch moments. He pushes him towards the wall. Good break. Nice break. And again, the down back two. Oh, the, just the shredder kicks into the simple down twist. Will be available until the end of the day on the last day of the event. Over there right now if you guys would like to play. Sticks will be provided if you... And they're right over there for you. Here we go. A oh, great wow. delay. They're able to get the follow-up. Oh. And now Jody the Great, way more confident with his offense here. Gets a nice slide. And it's the first time we've really seen the slide in this matchup. Gets a follow-up with the combo. Nice. That is so cheap. <laughs> you have to do that. You have. I feel like if you're playing a new character, you have to do that. Oh, you have to swag out. You have to show off the goods. And typically, it's not something that we really see uh, most high-level Shaheens do. But, um, I mean, since since this is one of those matchups where like you think your opponent doesn't know what's going on, might as well do it, right? Right. Gets a counter hit. A little too far for the follow-up, though. But Jody the Great, looking at... Well, he's playing very compact right now. Yeah. Doing such a great job. And he should be able to... Oh, he drops oh, it. Oh, wow. Gets the back throw. Lots of damage. He is in rage. He needs to be really careful. Nice punch. Round three. And just like that, Jody the Great, two rounds straight. Looking to even up the set here. Okay. Nice down two. Wow. Great great offense here from Sparrow Jin. Oh, didn't break the throw that time. Oh, can't punish it with that. Yeah, there Shaheen, you go. Sheen actually has a lot of tools to punish a lot of Paul's uh, moves, such as the death fist and the, the just frame on block. Oh, went for oh, that. Wow. Went for that hop kick once again. Before. Yeah. And you know, we haven't really seen that many juggle attempts from Sparrow Jin. There's been no down four or twos. We haven't seen that many hop kicks. One of the things I want to see from Jody the Great is he's not going for the ground spike. He's not going downstairs. And Shaheen excels in getting extra damage from that. There's a number of moves that he can use to get him into that state. He can use the chop, he can use 4, 3 plus 4. Uh, back 3, there's a lot of moves that we just haven't seen from uh, Shaheen yet. Oh, there, he's going downstairs to see the follow-up. Uh. Now, in that situation, he could have dashed up and down too to continue the combo. Alright, follow-up. Oh, okay, that, I guess that's a good option, yeah. Breaks the ground. Oh, wow. Oh, no. oh the it's, it's a shredder kick. To the mix-up. Oh wait, he doesn't hop kick there. It doesn't matter. Does Shredder kicks again anyway? One round apiece, final game. The crowd is cheering for Jody. I can hear him. All right, gets him with the one-two. Here's a follow-up. What's he gonna do afterwards? Gets the counter. This could be big. Oh, it doesn't go for the back four. That could have been guaranteed. Oh wow. Does down to him anyway. Walks. Oh, tries to punish the hop kick after the bait, but nothing. Gets the low parry. Can't get a small combo off of this. Oh man, I probably would have went for the down one to break oh, the wow. floor. Oh wow, he breaks the floor off of it. 
What's he gonna do? Oh Ooh, my goodness! Wow, I can't believe he broke that stun. That was crazy. I cannot believe he just broke that stun. That was one of the most interesting setups I've seen so far today. And Jody the Great opens up with a hop kick. This is gonna be big damage, pushes towards the wall. Now this is a bad position for Sparrowjin. Goes for Shredder Kicks again. This time doing a more competent combo, a little more damage. Oh, oh he he look okay. at the damage on that death. Oh, I thought he was about to do it again. <laughs> He's gonna have to be very careful. Get off of me. Get away with that. Oh, nice. wow. And we're going to the final round. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow, that was sick. The pressure is on. Let's see what happens. They trade on the on the launch there. Oh, wow. It's the 4 1. Jody the Great's been doing a great job converting off of those, too. Here's a big combo right here. Uh oh. And sparrowjin has been breaking those. But right now, Jody the Great. Oh, oh, wow. What a bait. He's still in there. That's why you can't whiff. Unhand me, man. You're not going to get away with this craziness. Oh, oh my, my goodness. Oh, my God. He did it again. Oh, my God. <laughs> Such a clutch play there from Sparrowjin. The fist of death. Yo, did you matchup we have Rip from SoCal versus Sparrowjin from New York and uh, we are down to our top four Steve can't wait to see what happens right now Sparrowjin definitely getting his footing oh my goodness oh wow that was great punish no block on the no duck on the second hit of the four two one all right goes for the hop kick there great punish there from Rip now both players playing a, a very good spacing game right now Sparrowjin opened him up a little bit there. Oh, good for the low. Oh, wow. This could be big. Is he going to go to the Rage Art? No, he goes for the Death Fist instead. Don't do it. Oh, the oh, delay. Oh, man. I can't believe he got hit by that. Should have went for the Rage Art like you said before. I'm pretty sure it would have took the rest of the damage. Yeah, he had enough life. And that's some, one of the things I guess you just have to adjust to uh, moving into this new game. Is because we didn't have Rage Arts back in the day. Exactly. Okay, follow up. Great, got the extra jab in. Misses the death fist though. Yeah, that extra jab actually puts you a little further away. That's why it's better to go for Demolition Man in that instance because you run in and you do down four, has a little more range. Follow up, nice legend kick combo here from Rip. But now Paul has rage, he's gonna have to be careful. Whoa. We've we seen what can happen with Paul with rage. Nice. Gets the back one, two, one. All right, we're going downstairs to the base of the volcano. Now, no walls available. Oh wow, what oh, a wow. whiff, but good reactions from Rip. Able to get the slide follow-up as well. Simple combo right into Death Fist. Here's the follow-up mix-up. Oh, oh my goodness, wow, Kachi another Death Fist. Oh, he got the counter and that should be it. Wow, finishes with Demolition Man. And just like that, brings back that wow. second round. Fight. Okay, nice slide there from Rip. Rip looking to get the pressure here. Oh, could have punished it. Again, Paul is one of those characters that can always punish the Dragon Slide. He has the ability to wall rising 3-2 that. Oh, okay. nice Dragon. Oh, nice. That's the one break on the throw. Oh, oh wow, rising 2. Great right. read there from Rip. He's not going to die, but he... Oh, wow, he did finish the combo. Nice stuff. Uses an armor attack. Wow. Like First game. Like oh, wow, with the Death Fist. Oh wow, I was going in for a throw. Rip was like, nah, we're just gonna hop kick. Not today. Nice. Nice chunk of damage. Now both players play very uh, very safe and defensive here. Nice sidewalk from Spiro. <laughs> oh wow, and Spiro's... he's back in the game with a death fist. He's been so good at scouting out the right times to do the death fist. He's gonna be a, such a threat once he gets more used to this game. Oh wow, gets up in the middle of the junkyard. And like I said, Tekken 7 is, is the return back to 101. So each attack in here means a lot more damage-wise as well as positioning-wise. Yeah, especially since it's uh, not like Tekken Tag 2 where you can heal between characters. Mm -hmm. Follow-up. What's he going to do? Legend Kick pressure. Okay. Oh, Much wow. The throw. Nice at all. Oh, wow. It whipped. That was really brave. I don't understand why he went for that throw after that flip kick. What yeah, if he did too? He could have died. <laughs> <laughs> That's like the scary thing. You don't know if he's going to do it with it. He did two right there. See, exactly. That's why I don't understand. I, just, <laughs> I didn't get it. But just like that one round away, Rip looking to move on. Fight. Right after this match, we'll have our winner's final. Oh, oh wow. Oh. And, he, and he tackles him right out of there. Goes right into Demolition Man. Spiel working on a perfect right now. Oh, my God. Round four. 
That was that was a great series there from Sparrowjit. Really needed that. Rip has an amazing uh, knack for making people play harder. <laughs> oh my god. And an amazing knack for getting hit with Delphus, apparently. Yeah. Oh, nice duck there. Oh, he got hit by it. That could have been it right there, but Rip not able to convert to a juggle there. Good nice stuff here. Break. Oh, that was a dragon slide. Oh, that could have been a punish, oh. but he got this. Oh, wow. For the bound. He could have. Oh, is he really doing team. it? Oh, oh he what? had a punish there. Okay, okay, all right. okay, okay. He still took the round. <laughs> Look at Rip that. is talking in between rounds. He said, I gave that to you. <laughs> All right. Nice. What of the back turn jab pressure? Oh, oh, he tried a reversal there. Rip looking really good in this round. Wow, oh. rising too. It's this, not going to kill. This is going to be very close, though. What's going to happen? Will he get the perfect back? Oh, that could have been. Oh, nice. Yo, no, you don't. No, you don't. Gets the mouth. Death fist. Oh, this is so scary. Oh, oh wow. Oh, he oh, drops he it. Oh, it doesn't oh matter. He landed the hit. Oh, one, two. Nice finish. Nice finish. Nice finish. That was good. That was good. I don't think he was expecting that, but... I definitely... Good stuff to spare. Guys, King players should always pick the stage. Yeah. All right, so... Good spacing here, Brawl Poe. Oh, you got to punish those. Oh, nice oh, little parry. This is going to hurt. Oh, he goes for the wall instead. Oh, into oh, the, wow. the chest bump. Right now, Brawl Pro looking really good. Yeah. All right, here comes the pressure from Rick the Ruler. Nice patience. Oh, too much patience there. This could God. actually be the end of the yep. And the floor won't break. Yeah. Wow, thirty second perfect right there. Yeah, he warmed down. Down four. Oh, again. Oh, wow, right in range. Into the wall and the follow. Oh, oh. the chop. A little too low there. Should be a big combo opportunity. Oh, he drops the combo. Knew what he's going for there. Oh, went for Atlas Hammer. Nice crush. Okay. Oh, Here comes the low. lows. Oh, no break on that giant you better swing. You that. better tech that. Josie now has rage though. Oh my gosh. It's such a scary place to be in. You don't want to be right in front of King like that. So two rounds straight there for Brawl Pro. Okay, low parry, follow up. Is he gonna go for the power bomb or is he going for the wall? He goes for the wall. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, hesitates there at the wall. Oh, nice, gives you the full crumple. This is gonna be, an oh, no combo. Gets the counter hit. A little too far for the follow up there. Yeah, I thought on, on the girls you have to do, you can only get the down three, four, like you can get alley kicks in the punch, not the. You can do it only when you're close to the wall. Okay. Follow up. Back into the wall. Oh, right into the Shining Wizard. No, no punish there. Interesting. I like That's Brock, punishable bro. too as well. She was in the backup. Oh, wow. Nice little parry again. Oh, okay. Get to the chest bump. Oh, man. Look at the pressure here from Brawl Pro. Wow, nice jabs. First game goes to... Really no advantage of that matchup, so back to basics here. Let's see what happens. Nice one, two. Down three. Oh, down back three. Nice. Oh, oh caught him. Good nice break, though. break on the Shining Wizard. Wow, lots of, lots of swings, lots of whiffs here. Both players respecting each other. Not really committing to any big damage. Oh, wow, nice drop kick. Goes for the slide. Here comes the punish. Nope. A little really too slow. Hard. You gotta do that. Really, yeah. I mean, the optimal punish there is to crouch cancel and sit down 4-4-3, four, four, but it's so hard to do. Okay, follow up. Nice. Able for the brakes on that. Does it get the Dragon Sands kick? We're winding down on time, but Rick the Ruler, he's making a lot of mileage out of that series there. Okay, nice Oh, duck. wow, nice duck. Here comes the punish. Into the wall. Follow up. Moonsault. Caught him. That was a great setup there. Those are 4 4 3 back. 1 2 in for the perfect. Oh, wow. Paul Pro's been racking up the perfect. Yeah. He has two so far in the series. Down three. I like it. 
Oh, 412. Oh, gets the counter hit 412. Into the dragon kick. Wow. So much damage. That was a solid combo there from Rick the Ruler. Oh, man. Uh -oh. oh, that is going to hit. Did you see Law hit? Like, oh my god. Well, I'm going that way. Downtown. Ugh. Ugh. So much damage. Oh, wow. I was going for the full crouch down 4 1. Nice down 4 1. Yeah. From Rick. Lots of respect to Rick, able to hold that composer, especially after getting hit by that rage art. Okay. They're great side steps here from Rick Early. You guys can you can tell that these guys yeah. play each other a lot. They're not taking those risks because they know the the potential that the other player has. Gets full full damage on that right there. Uh -oh. Tombstone, you're probably dead, bro. He's done. <laughs> what do you want it to say on your tombstone? <laughs> Gets the stab back three, goes for the follow up, try to catch him sidestepping. Oh, oh he threw nice right out of it. Throw. That was good. Alright, good punish there. Gotta do that. One of the new things that King can do now is since he has Armor Kings 4 2 1, he's able to use that in more instances. Uh, especially, uh, was it 14 frames? 14 frames is where he's able yeah. to get punishes. Nice. Doesn't get the full punish, but it doesn't matter. Good break there. Nice punish. Down 4-4 four, four to take it. If Brawl Pro wins this match, he will move on into the Grand Finals. And we see Rick the Ruler facing off against Rip. But let's see if Rick the Ruler has anything to say about that great break there on the ground throw. That is a pure mix-up. Oh, nice hop kick punish. Trying to get that wall throw right there Ooh. off the end. Nice jab to interrupt the flip kicks. Yeah, great float there. Oh, wow. It's going for a throw. Gotta punish those. There you go. Nice break Good on the break shot. On the shot yep. Rick the Ruler playing a little better right now. Oh, wow. Nice low parry. Not gonna take off too much damage. This is gonna hurt the. Oh, he misses the Dragon Sense kick. Oh, play that record. And that's something you always gotta scout and look out for towards the end of the round. That's a, a, like a law player staple, is the opening hits of the 10th Street. Oh. Here we go. Follow up. What's gonna do? Here's the pressure from Rick the Ruler pushing him towards the wall. Good option there. Nice break. Rick's getting a lot of mileage off of the blocks forward one plus two. Okay. Oh, he went for the punish, but he was a little too far off. This is gonna hurt. Now with his back to the wall, he's gonna have to be very careful. Brawl Pro in a very good position here. Oh, he goes for the multi-throw. Oh, wow. Yo, no break on the Shining Wizard yeah, that time. Point blank right there. Oh. Oh, Giant swing, jab. and that is it. Low jab into the class, right into the wall. So one round apiece in this final set, potentially for Brawl Ball. Okay, goes for the shove. Nice parry there from Rick Ruler. Here's a follow-up. Oh, nice raw raz and cool. Nice low parry, man. He's a low parry machine. Now he got some on the wall. Into the wall grab. Excellent work here. Oh, he gets the counter in. This is going to be big. It's not going to kill, but it's going to be very close. Now in rage. He's going to have to be. Oh, the people's elbow. Whoa. That was so sick. Rick the Ruler really a lot of pressure on him here for this round. Brawl Pro one more round away from moving into Grand Finals. Ooh, good stuff. Nice 4 2 1. That is new to his repertoire, like Mark just said. Oh, good, oh, nice good slide, slide. slide. Okay, that, that was a good punish. Nice back one, another great punish. Oh, nice duck, and that's going to seal the deal. Brawl Pro should be able to close that out right here. Running power bomb for the win. And just like that, Rick the Ruler. So. Winner of this match moves on to fight against Brawl Pro. Oh, man. Rick the Ruler is feeling himself. He is going in right now. Oh, wow. Down 4-2. Towards oh my gosh, look at all this. The mix-ups are working in his favor for sure. Wow, wow. rip double the rip. flip kicks. 
Wow, if he comes back from this. What a sidestep. Did not duck the legend kick. Goes for the 4 to a wild rise of 4 and they trade. And they trade in wow. favor of Ricky Rooley. He had enough life to survive that. Again, the hop kick. The Peru pushes towards the wall. Hop over. Oh, wow. He's going to knock him down. Yes, he does. Bait him. Run it. I knew, he, I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. <laughs> Follow. What's he gonna do? I mean, Rick the Ruler still in a good position. He still has rage too. This is gonna be a big combo. Goes oh, wow. right into the radar. This is the first time we've seen Laws today. Right into the flying kick. Nice chunk of damage. Don't know. Oh, I, good block. Don't know if I would have used that rage art right there. Yeah. Now he's dealing with a bad position. Cannot deal extra damage. And Rip playing very confident right now. Doing just content with. Oh my goodness. Yo. Oh. Breaks the wall, but he's not gonna. That's gonna hit. Oh wow! Wow, that was very unfortunate. That side wall stun really messed up the combo for Rick the Ruler. Rip able to clutch it out though. That nice slow motion ending for you. Oh, I don't think that's what he wanted. I think he was going for the wall rising four, but doesn't matter. Double dragon slide. Tries to retaliate with a slide of his own. Oh, right back at you. And Rick the Ruler, such a great job of challenging a lot of Rip's offense here. I don't know the character in and out. Oh, legend kick. Right into the dragon tail. One more hit. Rick the Ruler should be in range. Oh, oh my you're goodness. You're going to get hit. What a great read and reaction from Rip. Able to close it out with a clutch rage art. He's feeling himself. Look, he's smiling. He's so look happy. Look at him. He starts to cheese so hard. He's like, I'm feeling myself. I mean, it's, it's, it must be hard for him right now. The hometown crowd is definitely back in Rick the Ruler. Rip is uh, really cheering for himself at this point. Just okay. like that, Rick the Ruler is not doing too bad right now. Gets the legend kick after the parry. Let's see what happens. And Rip, the classic, goes for the hop kick. Oh, oh power to the people. Uh. I mean, that was a big gamble, but it, it would have paid off if he landed it. But still, he's going to have to be very careful in those kinds of instances. Dragon Tail, very punishable. Going to the final round here in this first match. Now, Steve, you play against both of these players. I mean, what, what do you think really is the difference between both of their law play? The, the thing is, I know for a fact that Rick Derula takes in a lot of information when it comes to matchups. Um, I've been playing him for years, and I can tell you right now, he does pay attention a lot to player tendencies as well as what he can take advantage of. He's, he's very much a fear-based player. He knows that you're looking for certain things, and he's going to take as much advantage of it as he can. So you're saying Rick Derula is Batman? Yes. Is Rip, on the other hand, he's Dude's a veteran, man. He's been playing. He's been playing Evo top eight place and, and multiple times, as well as what third place at the last Wizard World event. Uh oh, this is going to be very close to the wall and the follow. But now Rip has rage. Oh, he's going to have to be careful. What a clutch pop up oh, kick there! Oh, while standing for Rip takes first game. You lose. Rip and momentum swing definitely benefits Rip a lot. Oh more. wow, opens up with the flip kick. Oh, down for it too, and he's going crazy with the buttons right now. Los Putanes. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> Pushes him towards the wall. This is big stuff right now. Great punish there from Rip. Oh, you got to really respect the challenge there. That one, two, three counter hit. Oh, wow. That was so sick. He ran up and did nothing. Got in his face. He should be able to close it out towards the wall here. What's going to... Oh, no, he drops it. Oh, wild rising too. This isn't going to kill. This is going to be big, though. Here's the Oki. What's he going to do? Oh, my gosh. Both players in range. Oh, oh my goodness, wow. is that enough? That's a low. Oh, the armor. And the rage art again. Rip did such a great job. He knew he had enough life to withstand that. First round of rip. And that's for those people who think that you can just, you know, throw out a super and be safe. You still take the initial damage from that first hit. So if it could kill you or take the rest of your life bar, it's going to, and you will lose that round. Wow, nice counter hit there. Able to get the follow up. Here comes the ledge kick. Pushes towards the wall. Right now, Rip is doing such a great job. Uh, this is a, a big change from what we've seen earlier on. Yeah, Rip is definitely feeling himself in his gameplay right now. Oh, the momentum right now, the shift, and look at that. What a punish there from Rip. Two rounds straight. Round three. Fight. So Rick the Ruler is really going to have to turn it around right now. Rip is completely dominating the matchup. Oh, he misses the combo. Uh oh, here comes the rush. Rip is feeling it right now. Went for that hop kick. Obviously, lots of confidence there. Instead of trying to go for a clean punish, goes for a throw. No punish on the slide. Okay, caught him. Wow. 
caught him right out of the air. I wonder what he was doing. And again, the dragon slide. Such a such a surgeon with that, able to land it. Okay, follow up. This could be close to death. Drops the kick. Oh no, is that gonna hit? No, that's gonna get launched. Oh, and punished. Wow, he wouldn't repair there. Good setup. Both players just going at it. Man, defense is really high right now. Nice down forward two, and here comes Rick the Ruler. At the wall, is he going to get the follow-up? No, he doesn't. Just short of it. Gets the 4-12. Okay. Good stuff, and again, Rick the Ruler has been getting a lot of mileage out of those kicks. Opens up and gets that first round here in this third match. Oh wow, nice double throw. Oh, that's gonna get to the wall too. Oh, he, he doesn't go for a follow-up. Maybe a little bit too low, not confident in it landing. Wow, nice double side step, gets the 412 twice. Oh wow, gets wow. the bulldog. That was a great throw attempt there. Oh, he got wow, him. Rising to a got man. him looking. Oh, oh the Batman backhand. You see the hop over? Wah wah. Twice. Let's what a go. confirm there from Rip. So, even up on rounds right now. Again, Rip has the advantage. He's up two games straight. Oh, the fakey. Now he's going to push to the wall here. He should be able to hit it. Into the junkyard ender. So much damage. Oh, no. This is not looking good for Rick the Ruler. Nice hop kick again. And just like that, Rip one round away from moving on to grand finals. Rip needs to be really careful right now. He does not want Rick the Ruler to come back. Oh, counter hit 412. Nice. Wow, what a combo here. Gets the wall. So much damage. Right at 50% life. Goes down for 2 3. Nice punish. That is clean. And that might. No, he drops the combo at the end. Oh, and, and he seals ends it with a perfect. What an emphatic victory. And Lucky Chloe is actually really good against King, in my opinion. Except when you get hit by counter in like that. <laughs> Here we go. Brawl Pro able to get that opening combo. Is he going to follow up? Gets the ground throw. Great adjustment there. Nice damage. Takes him right at 50%. It looks like double alley kick. Nice launch. Okay. Follow up. Good combo there from Rip. Oh, oh wow. Double low parry. Both Not only is he a Brawl Pro, he's a low parry pro. <laughs> he's been landing that all weekend. Into oh, nice shiny. break on the Shining Wizard. Oh wow, I'm, oh, I'm not sure what Rip was going for there. But that jumping <laughs> that jumping jab did not work out for him. Fight. Round two. Wow, straight into the power crush. Good block there, but unable to punish it. Nice sidestep. He knows how to punish it. Okay, so I think Rip's not going to use Lucky Chloe anymore. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Oh wow, gets up. Through the moonsault. He scouted that one out for sure. Here comes the multi-throw. What's he going to go for? Yo, the oh, rolling really? death cradle. I'm going to go make a sandwich. This is going to be a while, ladies and gentlemen. I'll be back, guys. <laughs> yeah, you look at that, Rip. You turn around and you look at that. It's the <laughs> <laughs> and I've not seen that throw in a, in, in a grand finals, I don't think, ever. <laughs> I, I don't think it's ever happened. <laughs> so just like that, two rounds straight for Brawl Pro, making Rip really question whether or not he made the right move picking Lucky Chloe. It hasn't been working out so far, but he still does have a chance. Okay. Right now, the pressure. Oh, I'd like to see more down forward ones from Rip. That's a, actually a really good move that Lucky Chloe has to really shut down a lot of King's uh, defensive and offense options. Oh, there's the back one. That's punishable. That's not safe. Oh, just like just that. Just like that. First game goes to... Oh, caught oh, him right nice out of his move. giant swing. Tossing him to the other side of the stage. Here we go. Nice. Caught him moving. Nice, Weibu. Wow, another giant swing. I think he, he better take this. He might be dead. Okay, nice take because he definitely would have died. All right. Dex on deck. Your armor. And Brawl Pro playing really confident right now. Such a dominating first round. Oh, nice fake out. Hits him with the back one, too. In another, another giant another swing. Another giant swing. Rippin just not breaking throws right now. Another tick. Goes for full crack down, 4-2. Nice duck. Oh, wow. No, no punish on the flip kick. Back 1-2. He got the counter in there, but still, uh... Man, what a lead right now for Brawl Pro. He's looking really good here in this set. 
Okay, good break. Oh, oh no. run in up 4-3. That was nice. He's going to do it again. Oh, okay. wow. All right, he's going to get some decent damage here, but what's he going to do with it? Oh, had an opportunity there. Went for the toe kick. Oh, wow. Oh. The rip. Rip could do it here. Oh, she went straight for the rage. All right. What a comeback. Oh, oh my wow, goodness. Wow. Legend kick. Okay, all right. Great job, Rip. The crowd goes nuts. That was pretty sick. Yeah, that was pretty I got to give it up for Rip there. Can't count him out yet. Brawl Pro doing a great job spacing, but gets hit with the hop kick. Here comes Rip with a big combo. All right, follow up. There's the command grab. This is going to be big damage here. Not enough to kill, but it's going to be close enough. Oh, again. Once again, that legend kick two times to take the round. And Rip is working on his first game right now. Nice 2 1. Oh, karate chop. It's going to be big damage to the running power bomb. And here's the mix up on Oki. Oh, he goes for the multi throw again, but great. Oh, wow, rising too. Let's see what he does. Oh. Wall Rising 2, not too bad of an option against uh, King. Law won't get launched for it. Oh, here we go. Good back dash and good space. Oh, nice low parry. Nice. Tested him again. Is he going to put him in rage? Yes, he is. What's going to happen? Oh, oh Dragon Tail. Get to the side. That should be ending it. Oh, game two goes to Rip. That unscaled kick after. And Rip coming from the loser's bracket. If Rip wins two more, he might be able to reset it. We'll see. Nice, nice giant swing again. The giant swing has proven to be so effective in this matchup so far. I don't think I don't think Rip's broken one of them. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. Wow. That's going to push the wall. the wall. Oh, gets the wall. Throws so much damage. Oh, no. Oh, back on two. Nice throw break while rising two. He's on the wall. He, does he have a combo for this? Oh, oh, went for the low. I knew it. Don't you try you that do on that? me. Why would you do that? Round two. Great reactions there from Brawl Pro. Able to clutch out that first round. Oh, yeah. caught him out of the air. Oh. Went for the giant swing again. I mean, if I'm Brawl Pro, I'm going to keep doing the giant swing. Rip doesn't seem to have an answer for it. Try to mess up his rhythm now, going for the legs. Nice, gets the counter oh, hit. This nice. is going to be huge. Ball open to the wall. So much damage. Nice. Oh, delayed hop kick. That is a tech trap. Round three. Fight. So even on rounds right now. Uh-oh. Follow up, nice. Gets the back two. Rip doing a great job of spacing right now. Gets a nice slide. <laughs> Both players trying to find their distance, and that hop kick interrupts there. He's going to push him towards the wall. Oh. Good block there, too. Oh, no punish. Oh, oh my wow. goodness. Oh, oh. oh, okay. All right. All right, I respect that. China style a little bit, okay. We haven't seen that move until now. Wow, rising one. So Rip looking. Oh, oh wow, 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 rising two. Not only that, it's going to be a good position here. Uh oh. Rip is on the verge of going up two matches to one. That should do it. Uh oh. We might be on. We might be on. There, I like. Oh, they're releasing the vinyl sometime this week. I forgot. Uh oh. oh I'm so gonna listen to that. Gets the wall. Uh huh. To the ground throw. Good break there. And again, that's a pure mix-up. You can't tell which one he's going for. Punish. There you go. Could have had a four-two-one there. Oh, this should close it out. Or very close. Oh, that was it, man. Oh, Perfect. Wow. So much damage. Nice wall grab there. So bro. No, bro oh, bottom. No. You might as well go to the people's elbow after that. <laughs> you might as well. It's one of those situations where you have to. Oh, wow. Now, another good punish for the slide, too. You can do wall rising, too, too, because that'll always put it to the screw oh, state. Yeah. 
So King definitely has options. The system really fits him in this game. Oh man, and just like that, Brawl Pro with such a huge lead here. Nice. Down one, two. Uh oh, it's getting close again. Fight. Just like that, two rounds straight. Yo, oh, oh. Gorilla Press Slam. Ugh. He said, I'm trying to get home and watch WrestleMania. So exactly. I'm going to do WrestleMania <laughs> on you right now. Oh, nice throw break. Rip going a little frantic right now. Hit more buttons than usual. Try, not trying to let Brawl Pro get any kind of offense going. Oh, wow. Full crouch down 4-2. This is going to hurt. Great reaction there from Brawl Pro. He's going to push him right at the wall. Here's the mix-up. This could be the match. Not looking good. Rip's going to have to do some damage now. He can't rely on his life bar, saving him for Rage Art. Uh-oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, Low why would parry. you do that? That was a bait. Brawl Pro, two games. Oh, wow. Right, here we go. Two to two, Rip versus Brawl Pro. SoCal versus the Midwest. And again, this is the Grand Finals. Oh, wow. Hit him with the elbow. Nice down 4-4. Four, four. Oh, oh man. Using that. Uh oh, gets the Irish whip. Rip's been doing such a great job using that down forward four to really build the space that he needs. Uh oh. Counter oh, hit. Hits the magic four. It's gonna hurt. That's gonna be it. Oh no, he drops it, but it doesn't gets matter. The delayed hop kick set up again. Yeah, that that jump over has been working wonders for him. Landed earlier as well. Good punish. Good stuff. Gets the wall rising one series. Okay, leg breaker into the hot kick. Oh, he's getting inside of his head right now. Rip, Rip playing the, a lot more patient. Yeah, Rip with the pressure right now. He's really suffocating his style, but uh oh, here comes a giant swing to the wall. All this damage. I want that back. Into the multi throw. Oh, oh wow. what's he gonna go for? Here's the mix up. What's gonna happen? Yo, is he going for the bridge? Uh -oh. he stop right now. He's gonna get it. That's it. And that's I the think round. That's the end. Bridge of the king, ladies Rawr. and gentlemen. So much damage. <laughs> Rip's like, damn it, I got hit by that again. It's <laughs> <laughs> the second time. Oh, wow, rising too. This is going to carry him to the, to the wall. Yeah, it's going to push pretty far. What's going to happen? Oh, he drops it. Oh, nice gut punch. This is going to hurt. He's going to go right into the running power bomb. The crowd is going nuts. Still anybody's match. Oh, oh. gets his back. He, King's not going to get a good combo after this. He's going to have to do something like back three there. Oh, nice throw break. Oh, oh wow. Gets what a read. Right to the rage oh, no, wow. I wanted to see it too. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Rip giving him the nod. Like, okay. All so, right. tournament point right now for Bronco. If he wins this round, he will be the champion. Let's see what happens. Oh, goes for the tech trap this time and no punish. Here comes Bravo. Nice 4-2. Rip turning it on right now. Using that offense to make sure he doesn't get any himself. Oh. Okay, nice. Ollie kicks to the wall. Time. What a conversion into the ground throw. Big damage. One more mix-up potentially. Uh oh. Oh, Good nice break. break. Oh, nice side step. Oh, oh, low parry. It's not over yet. It's not gonna be enough, but it's gonna be very close. Oh, Down it's a three and Brawl Pro takes it. Make some noise for your champion, ladies and gentlemen. Brawl Pro takes it. Your Wizard World St. Louis champion.